leaders, has your job moved into back-to-back -back meetings and you can't even find the time to do the work that you were hired to do? Here's how you can better manage that. If you like this information, follow me for more. So like this is 100% me. <laughs> if I don't manage my time and my calendar properly, then I'm going to have back to back to back to back meetings all day long. And that is freaking exhausting. So here are a couple tips. Time block. Now there's that whole idea of like eat the frog. And what that means is do the hardest stuff, the most complicated stuff first. That's with an asterisk next to it. If you're a person who, you know, at 3 PM, like you're on and you're creative, then time block that time for those pieces that, you know, you were going to execute best at. For me, it just happens to be the morning. It's quiet time. I do my strategy stuff in the morning before I even look at my email. And so there is time blocked on my calendar every single day for an hour to focus on those things. So that's my first tip. The second is block your lunch. Like make sure that you have time to eat. I hear so many times people say, I didn't eat until 3 p.m. And that's so unhealthy. We want to make sure that we take care of ourselves. And so make sure you block that time for lunch. And then the other tip is don't work outside of work hours. If you restrict the amount of time that you have available to do meetings and you time block and you make sure you have time for lunch, that will restrict how many back-to-back -back meetings that you have. And so that way you're honoring yourself first and making sure that you're as efficient as possible, that you're on when you need to be, and that you have time to rest so that you can come back nice and refreshed.